How's it going? Hello. All right. We're from uh, KF May in Tucson. How are you guys today? That's great. Right. We've got yeah. Colette Wolf, Lizzie Kaplan from the new movie Hot Tub Time, Time Machine. It comes out March 25th or 26th. 26. 26. Okay, I think we're doing a special screening March. in Tucson. So. March, close enough. Sometime in March. Sometime in the month of March. So, you guys get to work with John Cusack, Rob Corddry, Craig Robinson, a whole list of characters. Um, tell us about your characters in the movie, Colette. Um, I play Kelly, who is a slut with a drug problem, <laughs> and um, she's just really fun, kind of party girl who, um, yeah, hangs out and uh, gets together with Rob Corddry, and I'm the mom of Clark Duke from 1986. Now, is that giving anything away for the listeners? I, I think that um, people will know that from the trailer. I think that's when the he trailer. sees me and says, Mom? Uh, yeah, that would call, probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think, I I think, think most people will figure yeah. it out. But. And Lizzie? I uh, play April. I'm mm -hmm. a reporter for Spin Magazine, and yeah. I'm just randomly there, and I meet John Cusack's character, and we spend one night together that really sets our whole lives in motion. Now, have you done any uh, journalism <laughs> before, like, leading up to your acting career, or has it just been movies? Um, I was an embedded journalist in Iraq oh, nice. for three years. Very cool. No, I've never done anything <laughs> like that. I'm not interesting. It, not interested in that at all? No, I'm not interesting. Oh, uh, not interesting. Oh, I'm not interesting. Oh, Oh, thank you. Yeah. It's the Red Bull. Uh, <laughs> no Chernobyl. <laughs> no, yeah, Chernobyl. Uh, Chernobyl. Chernobyl. Yeah, yeah, sorry, Chernobyl. sorry. Yeah. Chernobyl. Um, yeah, it's. Uh, I, I've. I've really. I've been a waitress and a busboy, and then this. That's my whole career. That's story. awesome. Colette, any crazy Colette's jobs in the eighties? Real job. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I had a real job. She was uh, a real person. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I'm a real person. Yeah. Lizzie, on the other hand, fake person. Totally. Not a real. Yeah. She doesn't really exist. Yeah. I um, was a behavioral counselor before I became an actor. Really? Oh, mm -hmm. I helped the that's, world. That's awesome. I did. I helped the world, and then I quit because I wasn't doing that great at it. I wasn't a great counselor, so here we are, an actor. Very cool. Anything from the '80s that you guys would like to see come back, or disappear, oh. stay away forever? I mean, we mentioned pumps, Reebok pumps. Yeah. But I forgot. Do you remember those double tongue sneakers? Yes, of course. Double tongue sneakers. You'd like to see those stay or come back? Come or? back. Oh, yeah. They're but amazing. maybe triple tongue. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They can do it. Whoa, whoa. Yeah. That's too much. Too much? <laughs> okay. High tops or low tops? Uh, high, high tops. High tops. For sure. Solid white. Ooh. Any specific color for the shoes? I think it had to have like a splash of neon. Neon, for sure. Yeah. In order to be 80s, yeah. Uh, okay, so both of you have done TV and movies. Any preference, Colette? Do you like movies more than television, or...? I think they both have kind of, um... Yeah, I just finished working on a, te a television show, like a multi-camera sitcom, and I think mm -hmm. they both, they just have different things. It's not really one's way better. Like, the sitcom, I was able to live at home, yeah. be in L.A., visit with my dog, you know, that kind yeah. of thing. And a movie, you get to, like, go to a different place sometimes, like Vancouver is where we yeah. shot a lot of the movie, and Fernie, places that I might not normally go. So, I mean, there's good and bad to both. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, um, working is, is good in general, yeah. um, but television, I think, is one of the things I really like about TV is you get a new script every week, but yeah. you're playing the same character, so it changes and you kind of evolve with this character, whereas a film, you kind of are going in and you're shooting something that you've read 20, 30 times, and sorry, I'm going to sneeze. That's okay. Go ahead. No. We'll pause. It's not going to happen. <laughs> oh, oh. Look at the ceiling. Look at the light. My help. Um, God. Ah. Now, did you guys oh, get to do any skiing or anything while you were up in Vancouver shooting a movie, or were they like, no, got to stay safe? Um, I guess we could have. I didn't, though, because I was lazy. Yeah, <laughs> I, I didn't do anything. No. A lot of partying, stuff like that? A lot of, like, oh, we have days off, let's go, we're going to go home, kind of. Oh, well, that's yeah. nice, go see the dog or cat. Yeah, or yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. Facebook saving lives. Yeah, very exciting. <laughs> Daughter, yeah. It was a real rager. Mm -hmm. uh, any, any good hot tub stories? Like real life hot tub oh, stories? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, they could be fake, we won't know. But. My first three pregnancies <laughs> were conceived in a hot tub, and there wasn't even a guy in the hot tub. They're just, <laughs> you know. Mm, sketchy. So the hot tub fathered my first three. <laughs> They're all right. They're growing up just fine. No three eyes or anything? No. No, they've uh, webbed feet. <laughs> Do you get it? <laughs> any, any, special, any special memories from the 80s that you guys would love to relive, Colette? 
Um, special memories I want to relive. Oh, I did a performance um, with my sister and my Aunt Maggie where we did straight up to Paul Abdul for our whole family, like it was a family reunion, and we got a standing ovation at the reunion. It was like the first time I was like, oh my god, I love this applause thing. <laughs> we had our hair and side ponytails, <laughs> straight up, not tough. And I would love to go back and oh relive that god. moment. I picture you like... <sighs> That's exactly like, how it was, but it was just like Aunt Marty and Uncle Paul, like, good job, <laughs> you know, like, I'd like to relive that. Big, big applause, applause and applause. everything from the family. Yeah, that was great. Yeah. Lizzie, anything? Uh, I would like, I, for some reason, I, I'm now remembering my very first Trapper Keeper for first grade, and it had a Cocker Spaniel puppy on it. I would like to Very revisit cute. that. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure you could find one at Goodwill or you know a swap yeah. meet of sorts. You're right. eBay. eBay. Yeah. Perfect. Well, thank you for having us today. We appreciate it. We're gonna head back to Tucson and have a good time. Are you guys gonna be at the party tonight? Yes. For sure. Awesome. We'll be there. What's your costume? What? I have an '80s inspired shirt and zipper earrings. Nice. Oh. Lizzie? I'm a slutty pirate. Perfect. <laughs> oh, you mean for this party? Yeah. This party. Um, yeah, I don't know. I have a couple different options. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah. Will we see a foot fist way too, by any chance, Colette? I'm sorry. Foot fist way too. Will you see foot this way? Will there be a remake? Will there be oh, another? Oh, one? another like a sequel. I gotcha. Guess. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I hope so. That'd be yeah. pretty cool. That would would be you return? Awesome. Yes, absolutely. Awesome. I kind of like the director. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah. We're married. <laughs> well, thank you very much. We appreciate it. Thank yeah, you, guys. Thanks.